Hey everyone, this is Wutzer here. I'm gonna do some guild war. First and for all, we have to check who is the highest might. So let's start with this. So let's see. That of Legends has 194,000. 184. Oh, that's pretty low. So none of these. And this one, ooh, this one, has, this one has pretty high ones, 213, 210. So I'm guessing these four, probably. And this one, yes, that's gonna be the top five. All right, let's start with the highest one. Let's see what he has. Lots of double evolved heroes, Skull Knight, Harpy Queen, Dredrick, as you can see. Probably gonna be high towers, so let's see. Yeah, this is not looking good. Ruita, uh, Ares already died. So I'm have, gonna have to change my attack in the next one. Also, Demogorgon died pretty fast. Okay, so I'm gonna put Demogorgon on the top this time, I think. And put my Ares on the right side. Should maybe be better. Okay, so let's start with Demogorgon and dropping my Ares on the right. Now Cupid, let's see how this goes. Looks like we did a little bit more damage and since Dreadrick is attacking on the left, I think I'm gonna put my Dreadrick there to tank and put my Demogorgon also behind him so he can proc on all the enemies. I think this is gonna be a lot better. Okay, let's see. So popping Dreadrake on top with Demogorgon, then my Ares and Cupid. Okay, let's see. This looks a little bit better, I think. We did more damage. No single hero died so far. Now my Ares is about to proc. Alright. Looks like we killed most of the heroes. Just Grimfriend is alive. But we have the tree left, so it shouldn't be a problem. Okay. And Dredrick has a little bit of healed left, so... Putting my Golem first and my tree in the back. So he's gonna soak up the damage. And this should be pretty easy to kill. My tree only has 4 or 5, so he doesn't proc instantly. Gonna have to put the next 5 on him definitely. It's gonna help a lot in Guild Wars. And this looks like a win. Okay, so we killed the highest one. Okay, I'm gonna have to revive my heroes. So I think 4 or 5 died, so time to revive all of them. We don't really want to make, we don't really want to play with like 4 heroes or something. That wouldn't be a smart idea. Gonna check with an, the correct artifact for health, because I'm not sure if they are. Looks like they are. Okay. I'm gonna show you my tree fast, because he's only 7 out of 10. And he's single evolved. I'm gonna show you right now. As you can see, 7, 10, 4, 5. So, definitely need to work on him since he's a huge help in, in Guild Wars. Okay, the second highest. Looks like a lot of double evolved heroes again. Harpy Queen is gonna be a problem, I think, since he does a lot of damage. When I look at his base here, it looks like the walls are a bit too long. So I think I might be able to attack in the middle. I think I'm gonna put my Dredrick right there with my arrow. So he's gonna soak up all the damage. And then I'm gonna attack from the corners. So let's see how this goes. <coughs> Sorry about that. As you can see, Dredrick is tanking all the damage. Let's see how the heroes are dying. 
Warlock is down. Skull Knight died once almost, I think. Yes, he died, so he now he's alive again. Looks like Tretrick is about to die also on the top. My team of working can proc once more. Yes, he did, so Tretrick is down. Now my Tretrick is going in with almost full health. He might be able to finish this off, I think. It's gonna be really close. Hope he doesn't crit on me. Come on, one more hit. I think we need one more, actually. Oh, he, he killed me. Okay, so this is gonna be tricky, I think. I'm gonna have to pull him away. I think the best option is doing this with my Ghulam. Trying to pull Skull Knight away. And finish the tower with my tree. I think this should be able to work if I can pull him away. Okay, let's see. Dropping my Ghulam first. And my tree on the right gap. Let's hope this works. 96% cat pretty much sucks for Guild War. Okay. Please turn, Skull Knight. Alright. Now finish it off, tree please. There we go. 100%. That's pretty good. Okay, time to kill the third one. Have to revive my heroes again. Have to make sure I don't forget one. Checking. Okay, time to go for the... Okay, time to kill the third one. Let's see what he has for us. This looks to be a little bit easier. Also double evolved heroes, but not Harpy Queen and such. So it should be a little bit easier. Gonna start with my Dread Drake to tank the arrows and the stun timer's damage. Okay, most of the heroes are dead. Yes, this is gonna be a clear win, I think. Just gonna put my Ghulam in 3 now, since it's gonna be 100% win. Right, and there we go, 100%. We didn't lose a single hero in this one. So let's see, the fourth one is gonna be... Lagging a little bit here, not sure why. Okay. Okay, let's see what he has for us. Double evolved pixie. Pumpkin duke somehow, so he doesn't really have heroes for a guild war. That's gonna be a lot easier for us. So I'm just gonna go on the side, I guess. Shouldn't really matter too much. Now my Ares and Cupid, and the, and the enemy heroes should be down soon. There we go, Demo and Gorgon clear them all. All the heroes are down, so this is gonna be a walkover. Almost. And there we go, 500 points, so not bad. And this is gonna be the last one. Let's see what he has for us. Ooh, this is not a guild war base, I think. Still gonna have to be careful with the towers, since it looks to be pretty high towers. So, I'm going from the bottom here. Tredrick to tank all the arrows. And now just clear everything. Shouldn't really be a problem. As you can see, Demogorgon is such a beast. Now to, time to clear everything. And we got 5 wins with 100% so can't really complain about this. And we got the most points we could get. So that's also pretty nice. 501. This is actually the most points I got I think, yeah 2500. Since our guild is improving in might. As you know. We are still looking for a few more members, since we are really close to Fortress Feud, as you can see. We still have a few spots open, so if you want to join, just let me know. I will put the link down below, so you can apply. Alright, see you in the next video, bye.